Well, in our various proud series, we've told you a lot of stories of rescues pulled off by police officers and firefighters. Our next story, uh, just a bit different, Jessica. It's a rescue for sure. Maybe the most important rescue here. Uh, the heroes here are the Public's Work Crew employees who, well, they went below and beyond to help. And it's all about a wedding ring. Here's Garvin Thomas. This is, ultimately, a story about timing and the triumph of good timing over bad. Uh, I froze. <laughs> the bad, Jenna Madrid says, happened in September in the bathroom of her Livermore home when she dropped her wedding ring in the toilet the very moment it was flushing. Just fell out of my hand. I figured it has gone. I mean, I figured it was in the sewer pipes. It was long, long gone. Jenna called a plumber, but it was too late. She was resigned to never seeing her ring again until recently when she met a friend for lunch. And I'm telling her the story, what happened. And she said, well, have you called like the, what is it, the water reclamation plant? And I never thought of doing that. So more than two months after watching her ring disappear, Jenna gave them a ring. And this so what we're looking at here is, is when Jenna's timing couldn't have been better. Miles, 300 plus miles of uh, the sewer system. Public Works Supervisor Mike Wells says a crew just happened to have been down the street from Jenna's home the day before. And the debris they cleared just happened to be sitting at the plant. It just happened to be sitting right here. John Browning led the crew that had done the work and was happy to look through the debris, but the chances of finding anything? Really slim. <laughs> really, really slim. <laughs> Yet, after raking the pile, then using a metal detector, there the ring was. He called me and he said, I found it. <laughs> and I about died. I mean, just, it happened to be almost like a miracle that she called the day after us, us uh, cleaning the pipes there. So, this just does not happen. The folks at the water treatment plant say they found lost things before, but never like this. Never after so long. For Jenna, it's a wish come true. And perhaps for so many of us, living through a year that feels like it's gone into the toilet, something good finally came out of it. Garvin Thomas, NBC Bay Area News.